Alright, nothing in the Flooded Fortress. We are good there. We are missing stuff in Overgrown. And Mushroom Dungeon. Was there... Oh, shoot. Or is there like a hook shot in Mushroom I'm gonna go back to Mushroom Dungeon real quick. I kind of almost want to... Finish off... This whole, like, forest area. Right, these aren't any different from the last enemies that were here. I'm gonna just assume there was a hook shot somewhere because we did not have a hook shot at a certain point. We did this one. I think I vaguely remember, like, maybe a hookshot area. I remember we had to come back here because you need a bomb glove to actually get that secret. And... I'm pretty sure we did what was here. But... Just in case if there was, like, more, like, I couldn't progress past this path. I guess I wasn't fast enough. Okay. Faster. Stronger. Faster. Mostly faster. Alright, and this just lets you... That's the problem. I, I don't remember too many paths where I, like, went too far and couldn't continue because of hookshots. Well, like, obviously here it would it could be freaking anything. I'm almost wondering if I could, like, get in there because that's where Frogman was for a little bit. He was just hanging out there. There has to be something I'm missing here. I didn't mean to fall fall. That was a little too much of a fall. Awfully quiet. I kind of feel like I'm remembering something over here that I couldn't do. Not here. I don't know. I could just be crazy. Look at all you guys just hanging out being weird. Okay, I thought maybe I could brute force. Okay. I mean, I don't think it would really be too bad if I brute force because it's like, what? There's like not really much going on here. What I, think I can think of is maybe if there was like a hole I missed. And that's not a real door. I remember that not real door because I thought it was a real door and it wasn't. We'll consume that. What's up here? Cause I would I would like to collect everything. Especially if artifacts are involved. Especially if artifacts are necessary. Since Jefferson had something to say about the teddy bear I collected. Which I wouldn't be surprised if that other things that might come up. Oh, that was a ladder. I couldn't even see. It was too dark. Another ladder. This led, like, up, up, right? Hmm. At this point, I'm not sure because this wouldn't count as the mushroom land. And I did get what was there. He confused me for a minute because his eyes were so, like, lit. Maybe I won't worry about this right now, and then... As much as I want to collect all things...
It could be like anywhere. Anywhere, anything. And this is what dropped me into the uh, hammer. I doubt I could get any more information about this either. I want to head around here a little bit because it's like the one area I didn't go back to explore, I guess. That I can think of. I, I could be wrong and there was more. I don't see anything here. I know there was like another shortcut out of here too that I didn't hit yet. Was this the path from the main dungeon? No, this is where I got the horn. And I killed everyone here. Everyone! There is one more door over here. I think. Because, yeah, that's a path out. But I think this leads to just an exit. I, honestly, with, like, this dungeon, I wouldn't be surprised if it's something I could totally have just done at any point. Like, maybe there's a broken wall that I just didn't notice. Because I can't see why they would, like, make me come back here at night. I think I'm probably just really blind and missing whatever is in here. In the same vein, there could be just... Kind of explored this area a bit. I didn't get that, though. Which would require me to climb. And hook shot off of that. I kind of forgot all about that seed. I wonder if that's the only thing I'm missing. That could also be a thing. Because... Oh, shoot. Seeds have been in boxes before. I could just not have even found the box that had a seed in it. That might be what I'm missing there. Malformed seed. Oh, it's not even a real one. It doesn't look like a normal seed. It appears quite rotten. Okay. I thought that seemed like it was a lot of effort for just a seed. With nowhere to go and left unreaped, the souls upon this island linger until they're drawn to nearby life. Whatever soul latched onto this seed has twisted and corrupted it into an aberration. If it grew now, it's doubtful any good would come of it. That's not good. I wonder if that could be used for anything. Like if I talk to the woodland spirits, if they might be into it. Well, now that we collected that, I want to go and see if the door is good now. I'm just curious to see. Yeah, that was the only thing we were missing in Overgrown Ruins. I'm going back in the Mushroom Keep. I'm going to find whatever's here. Was this always right here? Was there a box here at least? Please tell me there was a box here. Because I, I I did fight these things and I ricocheted a... Uh... There's a seed! I really hope there was a box there. I'm going to really be peeved at myself if there wasn't. Hopefully that's all I'm missing because I didn't find anything else. I did basically run through the whole area again, so... Well, I wonder if the, uh, if the door tells us whether or not we planted a se all the seeds as well. Yep, that was it. Alright, so we're just done here, right? Like, that's it. So, what I want to do at the moment is go back to Squidland...
Lost Cemetery makes sense. What's going on here? Did I come back here at night? There has to be something here for me. I think I tried to come back here because I saw the light. But now that we have pretty much a solid confirmation... I'm curious if there's anything else. I almost feel like that slimy soul I have might be something. What was here? What did I pick up that was there? A key, right? I just... I'm probably stupid. But I don't know what... I could do here besides just blasting things. Unless if I can do something later. I'm just really curious about that one. Lost Cemetery makes enough sense. I get it. Earn Witch's Lab is done, which is good. The Manor has stuff, which I'm interested in. Stay wait, wait, wait. No, this is where the witch boss was. Never mind. I was all excited, but I'm, I'm missing probably more seeds in the dungeons. I do want to kind of go there to see if we can figure out that uh, grave puzzle. I I really just had a, like a real big lapse of where the uh, sailor is. It's this way. Old Watchtowers, Camp of the Free Crows. This is not actually, there's a strand of sailor. What's Old Watchtower? Oh, that's the ice place, which again, we probably can start burning those, uh, those fire things at night, right? I'm assuming that's what that is. I'm also upset that I, um, I didn't do all this stuff because I thought it might be bad to do it with Jefferson on our back, but I think it was would have been fine. Oh, it's that way. I'm gonna assume this will get me a upgrade to the weapon. And I'm also assuming there's nothing down here because the camera really wanted me to know that the switch is gonna open that gate. The only thing the switch really could open. Before I go that way, let's do this one. Because I feel like, like, this is just, like, a bonus, right? I feel like the door is going to be a bit more than just a hat? Can I wear it? Oh, it's a token of death. I thought it was, like, a straw hat. Ancient cultures used to place these over the eyes of the deceased as a payment to the god of death for ferrying them to the afterlife. People from ancient cultures must have had big eyes. Yeah. Yeah, they got big old eyeballs. That's a cool coin. Coin that used to be placed over the eyes of the deceased in ancient funeral rituals. It originally belonged to Steedhone, the gravedigger, and probably came from one of the funerals he conducted. Steedhone is honor bound to lay to rest those who have passed and wish them peace beyond life. Wonder if gravedigger friend has anything to say about those. I also do really want to go back and check because I do assume the eyeballs are related to the, uh, yep, hookshot upgrade. And we'll plant a seed because I'm pretty sure we just want to do these now. There's no reason not to. Um, this is gonna be... Damn it, I already forgot how to fight you. You're wiggling! Didn't quite seem as bad as um, the other guy that grappled around. Because all you do is grapple and jump in. Okay, this was the... It seemed really aggressive, like he was getting ready to start slamming many times. It's 
kind of silly seeing him, like, put his face down so he can... Ah! 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 I like how it does, like, the bell ring. It's such a slow jump, though. So, like, the idea would be that he... You have to, like, keep your eye on him. But, like, it... I don't know. It doesn't really matter. Ooh! Well, that was fine then. Sloppy, but it worked. Alright, what does this do for me? I thought probably more damage. I can't imagine giving me, like, a long shot. Silent Servant has been vanquished and their soul power out of tears. Your hookshot spell now does a powerful slash if you use your sword while being pulled towards the target. That sounds sick! I really have not used a hookshot in combat a lot. Uh, so we are missing fire. Which I believe would be in the direction of um, where the Urn Witch was. Because if I am right about how those uh, statues work... Actually, we're here. We might as well try to do the stuff that's here. We have to go to the Watchtower and we have to go to... Another place. The Free Crow Society, actually. Which I think that's just the cave, right? Guess we should go there first. Maybe one of the free... We haven't actually gone there at night at all, have we? Um. Haven't used a hookshot in combat, so... That'll be fun. Uh, I do remember seeing those statue guys on the path to the Urn Witch. I guess... Besides the one that was in the great... The, uh, cemetery. Just, like, in the middle. They were all kind of on the path to the other areas, so... That kind of makes sense. So, I mean, like, this whole area was technically small. Everyone sleeping? Wait, you're not sleeping at all. Ah, the simple joy of TV. Some say it's not good for you to watch it all the time. Oh, you do have a TV, but you've got to allow yourself a reward now and again. Deadline. Z work orders. Z giant squid. Z Quite late for an adventure, eh? Couldn't sleep myself, I'm too excited at the prospects of the future. The air tonight has an extra fresh quality about it, don't you think? It is kind of fresh. Also, I forgot I need to come here to upgrade. Well, we no longer have access to the soul vault, I can still- uh, They're not who I want to talk to, but we will upgrade. I guess we'll upgrade magic. I could save up for these. But I feel- I could save- I, mm, mm, You know how I am. Oh, okay. Well, I see now. So there are five more of these. This is where these end up. I... Th those ghosts have to be for the crypt, right? I also wonder if that's the only thing that I'm missing here. Is that I need to do that. What was down? Oh, that was like the crazy ice wacky adventure path. Exercise caution. Yeah. Whack, wacky adventure path. I think if we go up here, we'll just be straight at the watchtower part. Uh, it almost looked like there was some light there. And I went in here. I think this was one... What, what, wait, what was this? We were here. Because there's nothing else. But I don't remember what was even in there. Uh, this should be the watchtower part, and we will see if we can use fire to do thing. The wind's not howling as bad. Yeah, that fire seems to be lit good now. Which is crazy, you'd think the wind would be howling a lot more at night, but whatever. So I don't remember how many of those there are. I also thought that hook shot was like a person, so I got a little spooked. When we get to the door, we'll be able to see how many there were, but I need to keep an eye out, because there's a good chance I'm going to miss one. A very good chance I'm going to miss many. 
hoping there's not too many enemies around. But we'll deal with it when we have to deal with it. I also think I hear an owl. I was kind of thinking nothing of it until I remembered owls were a thing. Alright, there are five. And I'm assuming we'll just go in there and get another eyeball. Owl, I'm looking for you. I really wish I remembered where these were, but... I'm glad there doesn't seem to really be enemies that respawned. Not a lot anyways, there's one, but I need to go around. Two unlocked. I need to get to like that path to get that one. Also, the uh, the summit obviously is gonna be a big deal because there was a moon thing there. Oh look, there's little goblins. But goblins down there. Don't think there was a fire here, but just to double check. No, it looks like it would have just been whatever item was down there. Oh! I missed and almost got myself killed. We'll find this owl too. I wonder if what they'll get me is just another thing once I complete it. I wouldn't be too surprised if that was all it is. Okay, so that's out of the way. Halfway there. Those are mostly the ones I remembered, so... I have to just try our best for the rest. I wish you guys could come up elevators. Go this way because there could be one around here. That's not one. Those are the weird lasers that existed. Oh, that was cool. I like that. That's fun. That felt very cool. Hook shotting to them like that. There's a very good chance I'm going to miss one. Or many. The big battle zone. It's hard to remember where things are. I didn't realize how gnarly that statue was. Is there a hook shot here? I guess so you just don't have to even worry about the path itself. Well, there's Owl. Uh, God, that was a really... I think that was me having to go back this way and around. And I was right, that was Owl, so... Uh... So the only other... The owl, other Owl has to just be at the Urn Witch place. Which makes sense, the three areas, not counting the cemetery. Didn't expect to see a fella hanging out over here. There absolutely has to be a fire on this ice path. Oh, no! My aim was off. Didn't think that laser would still be around. That was a little scary. Towers didn't have anything. 
I would assume and hope that the uh, fires themselves would be on something a bit more blatant. Like a tower, such as that. Which has me a little paranoid. Good chance I'm missing something. Owl! Yo, what up? Bye-bye. Yeah, that's part of an, one of those eyes. Another shard of the ancient tablet of knowledge. Okay. Alongside the other shard, you can almost feel it trying to tell you something. Or look at me. With funny eyes. Is there a collectible here, or was this where a fire was? Probably a collectible. But look how weird that is. That could be a place where fire needs to happen. No. Well, we got Owl, but we're still only halfway done with the fire. Don't know where the other ones are. I almost feel like, too, I was more... They were more visible to me during the day, which means... The nighttime's a bother. That's how you leave. Put the bonus over here. Let's see what the moon has to tell us. Hopefully it doesn't mean we have to, uh... I was going to say, hopefully we don't have to take Jefferson with us, but thankfully we don't to get the mysterious locket. Some kind of soul energy swirls within it. Locket. Oop. Oh, buddy, he had a pupper. I'm glad that opened up and we could actually see inside of it. Locket comes with a powerful energy as if part of a living soul is trapped inside. Perhaps its owner would like it back. Well, that's important. Here lies Monty. He was a good boy and my dearest friend. His time in this world is over. May he rest in peace. Aw, Monty, little pupper. How many more artifacts? We're not missing too many. Five. I wonder how many of them are important. Obviously, that one is pretty god dang important. Because it even told us maybe someone wants it back. That is just the actual exit. So, the, I would say the problem here is that this whole area opened up a lot with shortcuts. So, it's going to be really easy for me to just miss a location. I need to look around. Good thing is there really isn't that many enemies hanging out. I went down there and got that fire. This was the ice path, right? There has to be one here. There has to be one on this ice path and I missed it. Just need to look around a bit more. In particular, I wouldn't be surprised if it's where that laser eye is. Because this seems like it would be a certified heck of a... Oh, wait, it left. Laser eye's gone. I'm gonna say certified heck of a time trying to aim. But uh, without laser eye around, it makes things a lot easier. That being said, I still don't see anything. So, what's the deal? I have to be stupid. There's no way I could get like over to that tower. I, like, I feel like it has to be on a man-made object. But that could just be crazy talk. Did I come from this way, or is this bonus?
Yeah, I did. This is where I started. I wasn't sure. I wanted to make sure because of the fact that you could fall down here. But uh, clearly it was nothing. I'm gonna... Probably should just start from the beginning and make my way around. Because I'm clearly missing a big chunk of zone. Or just being blind, but, you know, starting from the beginning is a good way to unblind myself. To look around before I fell, just in case. There wasn't anything over here, right? Like, I think it would have been clear visibly. Like, it almost looks like there might be a hole there, but I can't imagine they would put something in those rocks. We're making our way back. I love all our little flower friends that we just kind of left around. Went this way, but didn't see anything. Hopefully it wasn't something that I can only reach from over there since I killed those guys. Fake lasers. Well, fake lasers being that they aren't active anymore. Which makes them fake. Nothing like in the back here. I wouldn't be surprised if it's like an area where the camera would shift so I can see it. I feel dumb. About as dumb as I felt not seeing that seed before. I think the only reason that hookshot was there was because there were boomerang enemies around. And now we're back here. Alright, now I'm gonna actually go back back. For real this time. Here's a turning. I remember where that was so that we got like two of them from that path oh there's a fire we found a fire it's okay everyone we got one did I get that from here sometimes I'm not positive on the angle that we're at we got one I found one that I'm missing. Maybe I maybe I didn't realize it and I already got like a bunch of them. Well, let's head back to where that door is. Wait, 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 wait. Nope. I don't know. I saw kind of a weird tower over there and thought maybe that was it. That tower, the one that's right here. There's one. I'm I'm getting back into it. We're missing one more now. I'm surprised there wasn't any on the ice path. It still makes me feel like I missed something. Just wanted to make sure. Oop, goodness. And it's right there. Jesus. It was all just right here. I walked by like all of these. The good thing is I'm heading towards the door now. I, th that's the problem with me in like puzzles. I, you can't even really call this a puzzle. It's a more just a visual 
like, spot the thing game. But I'm, like, so... I get myself so into this mindset of it has to be here. And I'm just missing it here that I just don't think of anything else. So this whole time, there was just this path that I didn't double check. And that was just it. And then all this is just going to get us the tablet. Which is fine. I have acquired ancient tablet of knowledge. You feel uh, its eyes gazing into your soul. Okay, let's, um... We'll, we'll have to see if we are done here or not. But I'm going to say let's uh, go to the urn area. And do whatever is there. Because I'm sure that's going to be a big thing. A big hullabaloo. Didn't want to come this way. I just need to get down to the main path and... I think dropping down here would be the easiest solution. Because it's right here. Alright, fingers crossed that there's nothing else here. I would have been very upset if there was more because I'd like... I basically just like scoured the whole area. 